guys and welcome back to another raid Jay legends video with me the real deal so we are going to be pulling mortal soul stones we've got 97 of these bad boys to get through um it's probably taken me about a month as an end game free to play player to save up this many um but you know that's how i like to do it i definitely think it's better to save up a whole bunch and then start pulling um and let's just have a quick look at the wish list so we got Leora's on there who is one of my strongest nukers on my account and we've also got Arbiter because she's great for Arena. Speed lead is really important on her. And then we've also got Pytheon as well, who's just an absolute amazing champion. Um, great support. So I've sort of tried to balance it out between support and nukers for Arena. Um, but also, say you needed like to do something in Hydra, then I would definitely recommend switching it out for one of your really strong Hydra champions as well. So we've got 97. Let's start pulling. And let's see what we get. Oh, and straight off the bat, we've got Legendary and it's Noble. Um, absolute trash. Ninja is an absolute beast. Um, so yeah, love Ninja. Can't get enough of him. One of the best things that Raid ever done in the game was give him away for free um, a couple of months ago. Um, yeah, smashing champion. Smashing, smashing champion um who else is good here so golden reaper's pretty decent as well um demitha um great for unkillable team comps as well and loads of other content you can use her for as well and looks like we're getting a bit of a rare tax here uh cormac new champion not used them don't really know too much about them come on another gold who do we get Krutraxa. Um, a champion that I don't have, but I actually really do like her. She's got quite a cool kit. Um, and she, even like, though she's single target, she, I think she hits like four times. So even if someone does have like an ultimate death knight, she can actually still take out your champion because it's, because it's four hits. So yeah, really cool champion. Really, I really do like her. I do think she's quite underrated. <laughs> Elagias, just absolute trash. Um, he was a fusion champion. Uh, I invested a lot into him, and he was just not worth it at all. Um, Morley is an amazing champion. She can revive, and she's really good in a uh, arena. So basically, she'll provoke them. And every time she gets hit, she will basically increase your team's turn meter. And basically, you can sort of just cut in and just smash the other team. She's such a strong champion. Uh, Painkeeper is on my wish list. Um, just basically, I use them for my unkillable team comp. I can do a bit more damage. Um, so yeah, solid, solid champion. And oh Shamrock. So Shamrock is a champion I don't have. Um don't really see him too much in the game, but he does have some use in Hydra. And it looks like we are full. So uh I'm just gonna make some space. And we're back. So we've got 27 to go through. So let's go, let's see. Can we get something that I actually need? I mean, I'll be honest, I kind of hate how this system works. For example, um, like my Constantine, um, I've been building up slowly and I've got three stars on him at the moment. But, you know, I could get like, say, two stars and then it's just completely worthless and I just sell it and you don't really get much out of it. So I really think they need to rework how you can awaken champions. The system, it needs, it needs a rework. Uh, I do actually have Longbeard. I've not geared him up a bit about yet, but he is a pretty cool champion. I do like him. Um, don't really know if there's any blessings that really benefit him, to be honest, but he's a pretty cool champion. Uh, Padmea, really old school, not amazing. She's not bad, um, but there's some content I do use her for. Um, she can be useful for Hydra. Um, so basically, it's her A1's really powerful. Um, it basically puts a decreased attack on all the enemy. And I do use her in some Doom Tower bosses as well. Uh, Lothar are all. Um, I actually skipped them. I think they're sort of like run of the mill. Nothing special. And yes, we pulled Pixnall. The worst champion in the game. Uh, I think Raid have tried to um, buff her three times now. And she's still trash. She's still one of the worst champions in the game. Um, that's 100% a sell. 
So let's just have a look at who we've got. So it's really frustrating because there's so many champions I don't have here that I'd absolutely love, like Necred, um, Acrecia, and Hepafrek. I mean, those are probably like the top three, or Candifron as well. Those ones were, would be top, top on my want list, uh, on my wish list, if I could just get them with shards. But yeah, I'd love to know who you guys are after. Good luck if you're uh, pulling soul stones today. I've been The Real Deal. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Peace.